Brr, that's cold. This is D&D Tom Farms, first YouTube video. We'll see how it goes. Um, if you're looking for more information, go check out Instagram. I have a page, a bunch of posts, more information about us there. Um, but I'll just show you what we do every day. So, they, you can't really see it, but they're gonna mix feed here. They're just getting sidewalls off the plastic that uh, hold the plastic down and they're gonna start mixing feed. So, I'm gonna go do my calf chores. I guess 11 degrees at night is too cold to allow me to break the ice with my foot in the morning in these small pails. She's a little thick, I'd say. A little bit. Had to get the hammer out. Note to self, don't give them so much water. All right, so we're going now. We got tourists now we're coming out here to see. We got a contractor coming to do some work. No, he's not here yet. Back to the shop. All right, so since that contractor's not here yet, he's gonna run up to town, grab a pin for the excavator. We're gonna put that back together. But for right now, I guess we're gonna work on this. Do some greasing, yeah. We'll be right back. All right, so we just we put that excavator back together. Now we're gonna go. I have to get the pickup started. I guess we're gonna run into town. We're gonna get a couple tubes for a driveway. Uh, they dug the ditch and they ripped. They threw the tubes out. They're junk anyways. But we're gonna run into town, pick up a couple tubes. And we'll see where we go from there. Putting death in the old girl. That's right, folks. No fancy death bogus here. She runs on straight dinosaur bones. A good old fashioned kind. Go on there. Go on there. See, that wasn't so hard. That's how we like to load stuff. So we just loaded the excavator. I'm taking this dump trailer back we have the silo that we busted up. Well, we're gonna bust it up. We tore it down this summer and we're gonna build a little dike in the ditch bank because here about two weeks ago or so, a week or so ago, we had about two inches of rain and washed out a ditch bank. So we're gonna go back and build that up right now. We'll see how that goes. So that's what's left of the silo there. There's some up there still, but he's breaking that up. We're dumping it in this trailer and then we're gonna haul it over there somewhere out in the field for a ditch bank a dike we did that one time a couple years ago from a bin footing but it just washed out right next to it i guess so we'll see what we have there's some tubes they went to get they just used old used tubes that we got from the county um they should work good for our driveway project down in one of our fields just to go to the back field um yeah it could just be a personal opinion but i don't think this silo is going to hold feed like it once used to okay so there's a spot right here that got washed out you can see it goes out into the field here so we're just dumping this uh crushed up concrete from that silo we're just dumping it in there and we'll come back probably and work with it, level it off, throw some dirt on top of it. But that's what we have going right now. So there actually used to be, there the silo, you can still see it right there, the base of it. And we just about got it all, have it all cleaned up. But there actually used to be two grain bins sitting about there. And there used to be a dryer bin too. And then they had there was a leg, a grain leg, little grain leg right here. And we actually took the grain leg and the two bins, we moved them all the way up. The far, our farm is right there. We actually moved them up there on a trailer and we used the grain leg as a wet leg for going into the dryer. And we used the other two bins just like you would, just like you would use a bin. Um, that gave us a lot more storage that was several years ago now but it's a lot cheaper than building a new bin well ladies and gentlemen that looks like it's about a wrap for that project 
We have pretty much most of it all gone. There's still a little bit left from the base right there. But other than that, it looks pretty much pretty good. So we're gonna go break for lunch probably. It's quarter to one. See you after lunch. So I take that back. I guess we're not actually getting lunch right now. Right now we've got a const our contract contractor here. We're gonna build a little pump house to keep our electric and water lines inside and keep them warm. We're just building a little lean-to right off the side of this our shop here. And then it's not gonna be very big, but we got the auger on to drill some post holes. So yeah. Hey guys, well, you saw most of what we did today. Uh, we finished the day off, we built that little pump house, well house, whatever you wanna call it. Uh, we don't have the steel yet, we'll get the steel soon. I'll show you guys when we put that up. Um, if you liked the video, learned anything, don't be afraid, subscribe, like it up.